a live look outside at Lakeshore Drive. Just beautiful out there. You can see the shadows from the buildings, the sun shining bright. Mary Kay's here with a check of the forecast, which is hot and humid, and right. we've got some rain headed our way, too. We do. Not until Wednesday, though. We could really use it, but it's going to take a little time to get here. For now, it's all about the temperature. 89 was our high at O'Hare. Usually we see 82 this time of year, but the record for this day back in 1944, 98 degrees. Well, the air is getting pretty stagnant, and the heat and humidity will build tomorrow. The winds will be light, so all of that together kind of traps the pollutants here at the surface. So we have the air quality alert up through the whole day and the evening on Tuesday until midnight, and that's for Lake and McHenry all the way through the city, back through to Aurora and even into Grundy County and Will. So for tomorrow, we're going to see the sun start and then the humidity building, and ahead of that rainmaker, we'll pull the high clouds in, but temperatures tomorrow are going to be pushing closer and closer to that 90 degree mark. Some of you in the suburbs will easily see that. Then we get wet on Wednesday, and it does look like we could have chances for some heavy rain because of the slow forward speed of these storms once they fire, and also the fact that there'll be a lot of humidity available to kind of build those storms. We're at 87 right now, but notice the winds out of the east at 11. A lake breeze for us today, even though it's light, it is with us. That's not going to be the case, though, as we go through the day tomorrow. Weather watchers are finding some very, very warm air out there. We have low 90s as we look further out in the western suburbs. We have 91 degrees right now in Streeter, and that was the high in Harvard from Gilbert and Rensselaer 89 and Schaumburg 89, Rich and Gurney 85 degrees for a high temperature, and we're still holding at 89 from Margaret in Downers Grove. She was giving us a beautiful shot of her garden. Nice color, but it could use a drink, and it's going to get wet on Wednesday. Even into Thursday, rain will be with us, but the stagnant air of high area of high pressure is going to really push the air down at the surface. It will be drying and it will be very stagnant. So that's one reason why we have the air quality alert in effect during the day tomorrow. That system does move away though and we're targeting the next front which is now crossing into the Dakotas. A little light rain ahead of it for the moment. It has not made the tropical connection just yet but you can see the moisture from Wichita to Omaha starting to move north. These two areas are going to connect and sort of target Chicago for Wednesday. Ahead of that is the heat. We see 92 in Des Moines, 91 Minneapolis, 88 degrees in St. Louis. So a lot of the heat comes first. And as we look at future cast, here's two in the afternoon tomorrow. Just high clouds moving in. Then we see that tropical moisture start lifting to the north and merging with that system. So by daybreak Wednesday, it will be wet with heavy downpours for the morning rush and during the day and perhaps for the evening rush as well. Even into Thursday, we're going to pinwheel these showers around the region. So very wet for us Wednesday and into Thursday. Computer models for those two days do paint out at least an inch and a half of rain. Some areas could go over two inches. It really depends who gets under those slow moving storms as they move through Wednesday. So we're dry in the short term, but then we get pretty wet. 70 for the overnight low. All of us heat up tomorrow. No lakefront cooling for you. So if you're coming downtown, temperatures will be pushing close to 90 degrees with that humidity building. So we're wet on Wednesday, wet on Thursday, maybe an isolated shower left over on Friday, but here's the prize, Rob and Erica. Look at that weekend. Mm. I know it's days away, but we can't help but look at it. <laughs> we always look ahead. <laughs> <laughs>